as somebody who's a strong manifester and for everyone else too, I just want to caution you to move in silence. To move in silence, meaning when you have a clear desire or vision for yourself or for your life and the people perish for a lack of vision, we have to have a vision for our life. We have to have a desire for ourselves. We have to have a plan. Franklin Covey was like, write down everything, five-year plan, three-year plan, one-year plan. We have to have that vision in order to actually see it come to fruition. However, be very careful about who you share that vision with because people have the power to contaminate the energetic form and pattern of what you're trying to manifest. Say you're trying to manifest a 25 pound weight loss because it's good for your health, you look better and you just really want to manifest that and you can do it and you can work in your imaginal mind and you can set goals for yourself, you can write it down and boom, we're off to the races. However, you go to a family reunion and you start telling everybody, yeah, I'm going to lose 25 pounds and here they are pushing the ice cream for toward you, right? Have you ever been around people like that? Or, oh, eat some more chips. They'll actively sabotage you or they will in their own mind have reactions inwardly of failure or cynicism because of their own stuff. Maybe they don't want to see you succeed. Maybe they need to lose 25 pounds. I don't want her to lose 25 pounds. What I'm saying is when you put your stuff out there that you want to manifest, you create this vision, which is an energetic pattern and form. Let it be pure. Only share it with people who can hold space for that vision, who will connect to it and build it according to what it is that you've stated you want to create. Otherwise, you can have other people ruin what you're trying to manifest. It's happened to me many times. I jumped, I jumped the gun and started sharing with people what it was I was going to do. And before I knew it, my projects get derailed. My inspiration gets tapped out because the people themselves are draining the thought form of my manifestation. To learn more about me, the services I offer, and also my online spiritual community, please visit me at crystalancompton.com. See you there.